During IDEX last year, it was announced that the competition to develop and field a new 8v8 for the UAE had been won by Autocar in, in a joint venture with the UAE. That was just shown fitted with the complete turret of the BMP3. This time they've showed it again with a different turret. This is fitted with an, uh, with an Autocar turret armed with a 30mm Mark 44 cannon and a 7.62 chain gun. As you can see, it's got a stabilised sight and this vehicle is now entering production and we understand the very first production vehicles will be delivered to the OE later this year. It's a major contract for over 400 vehicles. The hard-fought competition was won by Autocar in conjunction with a, another company in the UAE as a number of countries now want a more of a co-production. They just don't want to buy the vehicle. They want to start off with buying some vehicles in and then a progressive transfer of local production in their own country. That will start by perhaps making the hull and then the engine, transmission and drive line come in from abroad and then things like the weapon station are often selected by the end user. For example, the one we saw last year was fitted with a complete turret of the BMP3. And why was the BMP3 selected? Because that particular vehicle is used by large numbers by the UAE Armed Forces and is armed with a 100mm gun, a 30mm cannon and a 7.62 co-action machine gun. So they have lots of those turrets. And the unusual feat of that turret is that in addition, the 100mm gun can actually fire a laser-guided projectile, which gives you a big increase in range above the 30mm cannon. This particular vehicle is also fully amphibious, being propelled in the water by two propellers at the rear. And it's got a module armour package, so you can upgrade the armour to suit the threat level.